All right, welcome to the channel. My name is Dan and this is Viking Designs. All right, today we are talking new tools. Pfft, love new tools. Good are new tools. Mm. Celebrate with a drink. I've just recently got my hands on the brand new Bosch table saw. This is Bosch's first go at a battery powered table saw. So I'm super excited to get my hands on it. All right, look at what I have just received. Battery powered, how good. Battery just goes here. Bit of dust extraction on the back there. Push stick, that's nice. Little home for that in there. In this video, we're just gonna take a first look at it, see what's in the box, see what it looks like. A more in-depth review will be, uh, will be coming later on. So stay tuned for that. So today we're looking at the Bosch GTS 18V216. This is a portable, job site table saw. Now it's powered by one of their bi-turbo brushless motors. And it's intended to be used with one of their Procore batteries. Now a table saw is a bit of a weird one. It's not something that every carpenter needs. Uh, I'm sure there's a ton of carpenters out there that don't own one and get by just fine without one. Whilst you can probably get by without one, having one definitely makes life easier. Especially if you're trying to rip down some small timber using a circular saw for that can be dangerous whereas doing cuts like that on a table saw are super safe easy to make repeatable cuts when you do have one of these in your kit it definitely makes life as a carpenter easy but first let's check out the numbers So this thing has a 70 millimeter cutting depth up to 635 millimeters ripping capacity. It weighs just under 22 kilos. The dimensions of the table are 658 millimeters by 553 millimeters, which makes it easy to move around easy to store. Now for maximum power, Bosch are recommending you use at least a 5.5 amp battery. And in Australia, it also comes with a six year warranty after you register your tool. Now, what is in the box? It comes with a fence. One of the better fences on a table saw, in my opinion. It comes with a blade guard, a push stick, which has a nice little spot to store it underneath. Now the one that I got was skin only, so you'll have to BYO batteries. And this one also didn't come with a stand, but it is compatible with some of their other table saw stand. Now my first impressions of this thing, it looks really well made. The fence fits super tight, which is what I really like about the Bosch uh, table saws. Some of the other brands, even when you lock down the fence, it still just doesn't feel super solid. Whereas Bosch has managed to ensure that your fence is nice and solid. The fence locks off nice and square to the blade, which is super important with the table saw. This thing does feel really well made. It's got a couple of handles, which makes moving it about nice and easy. And yeah, it all runs on a battery, which is pretty crazy. I know Dewalt's had a really popular portable battery powered table saw on the market for a while. So it'll be interesting to see how this thing goes up against something like that. Now, obviously if you're doing some heavy duty ripping, ripping down hardwood or something like that, I don't imagine that a battery table saw is what you want to be using. However, if you're doing architraves and trims and ripping down pine and things of that nature, then this seems like a great option. Nice and portable, don't have to worry about power or leads and it's easy to pick up and throw in the back of the truck. One of the things when it comes to table saws is they are generally a pain in the ass to move about. They're usually really heavy and then you've got to plug them in and get the cable out and who could be bothered? So by having an 18 volt one, I think you're much more likely to pull it out even if you just need to do two or three cuts. It's so easy to set up and get going that I feel like you're much more likely to use it. Anyway, this is just the first impressions. Check back soon for a full review. 
Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope to see you guys in the next one.